Hey, Ryan, uh, game's back and forth through the first four innings there. You guys get the lead. What's your mindset coming in there uh, in the fifth inning, knowing what's on the line in this game? Yeah, I mean, uh, first couple innings were kind of crazy and back and forth kind of thing. And, uh, you know, I think, you know, Kopech came in and did his job. You know, he, he needed to eat some innings. We need, you know, big outs right there. And, uh, you know, my kind of mindset was to kind of just throw up some scoreless innings. You know, we uh, just attacked the zone and, you know, it was kind of a momentum switch almost. And, you know, it was just uh, being confident and throwing pitches, kind of mixing it up and, you know, getting the momentum back on our side. Again, on your left, not halfway up. Ryan, there were some big expectations for this bullpen in the preseason. Obviously, you joined in the middle of the year, but what are your guys' expectations, uh, you know, now that it's the postseason or even on a nightly basis for what you guys can do? Yeah, you know, I traded over here from the Cubs and was brought here to win a championship, you know, and be a part of a great bullpen. We got some good arms down there and, you know, give credit to Kopech and Bummer tonight. Man, they, uh, you know, they really threw the ball well, especially Bummer. You know, he was lights out. Um, that was a big help. So, uh, you know, all I can say really is it was a lot of fun. I, I had, it's been a while since I've had that playoff atmosphere and, um, you know, the, the stadium was rocking. You know, obviously it's a, it's a different game here at our field. You know, you play at Minute Maid and, you know, they're, they're doing something over there that's a little different. You know, it shows you how many uh, swings and misses they had tonight compared to at Minute Maid. So, uh, you know, that's why you have home field advantage. And, you know, tomorrow, we look tomorrow, and, you know, we got another home field advantage. So we're ready to go. Middle right, Sahadev. Uh, Ryan, it's been like since middle of July since you've gone over an inning. They just, just how did you feel after that first inning and getting back up and down? And how confident were you that you could go two? And it's, it's, Tony said you, you were ready to go three. Yeah, I mean, it's a uh, playoff atmosphere, man. It's adrenaline rush. So, uh, you know, obviously the pitch count was down. So, you know, I was able to go out for that second inning and, uh, you know, execute pitches. And, you know, I felt great, you know, just riding kind of the the adrenaline and, and the high, you know, it's uh, it's a good feeling. It's fun, man. That's what uh, that's what we live for. We're competitors, and you know, we go out and try to compete. You know, that's that's the top of the, you know, top of the league right there, and that's that's what we live for. Far right, Scott. Ryan, after the game, Liam was excited to tell me about you getting the gauntlet. Can you explain what that is and what it was like when you went back into the clubhouse just now? Did he give it to you right away? What well, was that like? first of all. <laughs> I didn't get the gauntlet. Bummer got the gauntlet. Oh. So it's when uh, it's a little funny joke we have in the bullpen. And basically, when you strike out the side, you get three strikeouts in an inning without giving up a run. Uh, we have this little uh, Lego set that's a, a gauntlet, and we pass it around for every guy that gets you know three strikeouts in an inning. So credit to Bummer. He was lights out. He's the one that has it right now. So hopefully, I'll get it back tomorrow. When did he give it to him? Just now? Like yeah. right after? Cool. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thanks. Any final questions for Ryan? Oh, back, left center. Hey, Ryan, I was wondering if you could uh, uh, expand upon what you were saying earlier. They struck out 16 times in the previous two games, but then 16 times tonight. Do you think something else is going on still, or is that just like a hunch given the past? Yeah, I mean, you know, it is what it is. Uh, they've obviously had a reputation of you know, doing some sketchy stuff over there. And, you know, it's just, uh, we can say that it's a, a little bit of a difference. You know, I think you saw the swings and misses tonight compared to, uh, you know, the first two games of Minimate. But that's not really the story, you know. Um, we come here to play, you know, we're going to compete. We're not going to worry about what they're going to do. Um, all we have to do is execute pitches and they can't hit them anyways.